Are y'all excited? Are y'all excited? Because I am excited. Okay. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new, thanks for clicking on my video. I have not filmed in a hot minute. So if I'm a little rusty, bear with me. Things have been crazy. I competed recently and then with just everything else going on, hosting an event, a powerlifting meet, and then training to get ready for another meet in September, it has been a lot. So I just needed to make sure I was in the right headspace to give you guys the right energy to make sure I could do this and make y'all want to watch. Who wants to be sitting here watching? This is so nice. I love this product. No, we don't. So... Today's video is going to be a review of another colored contact lens company. These I was really excited about because they actually had some really bold colors, but they still looked really wearable. I'll get into all the details in a minute, but before I do, if you're new, I would love to have you join the family. So please hit that subscribe button and turn on your notification bell so you know every time I upload. I do mostly makeup content, beauty related, hair, makeup, nails, skincare, hauls, lots of hauls. And I do a little fitness as well, so I think you're going to find what you like on this channel. So if you want to see the contacts that I am reviewing today, then stay tuned and keep on watching. All right, so we are gonna get straight into the details. First, I wanna tell you a little bit about the company. This is an international company, so these did ship to me from overseas. The name of the company and where I ordered from is, I believe it's Tint Iris. I'll put it on the screen, but online it just shows www.tintiris.com. And they reached out to me and asked me to do a review and they wanted, they let me pick what I wanted. They do have prescription contacts as well as non-prescription. So you can get your prescription or you can just get something if you don't need a prescription. I absolutely loved the colors that they had on their website. And the thing that drew me in the most was I found a pair that were purple and you know how I am about purple. So I was just like, yes, I have to have these. They shipped out quick and you got your tracking. Everything was really easy. They have actually been in the industry. I'm looking at my notes to make sure I get this right for over 20 years. It actually says that this is their new retail brand that launched last year in 2020, but it does also say that their contacts are FDA approved. So this is not just me slapping some random silicone or plastic or whatever this is in my eyes. This is FDA approved, so it is safe. So I'm gonna go over which ones I picked and tell you the colors and then we will get into the try on. So the first pair that I got, and I'm gonna put a little picture up here on the screen. The first one I got is Lavender Gray. Then I got Summer Sky. Lavender Gray, Summer Sky. And then I got, it says premium green, which I'm not sure. Okay, premium green. Then I got glass ball, which I was really excited about those. And then the nano violet. I will probably save those for last just because I'm really excited about them. And then I also got ochre which is kind of a brownish green. So this is what the box looks like. And they each one is different. So I wasn't expecting to get this many. Super excited. Thank you so much for that, Tintiris. And then they also sent... Oh, I'm going to have to go get some more. So they sent the cases that you can save them in, but I only have four here. I do want to show you... I think I'm gonna show you all of them in my eye. It depends on if my eyes get irritated or not. I'm not sure, but let's just see how it goes. And if I need to go get more cases, then I will. So right now I have my contacts in, clear contacts. AccuView 2s are my absolute favorite. These, I got all of them in my prescription. Oh, wait, okay, so yeah, that's what it is. I ordered four and then they sent me 
two that were not prescriptions. So Lavender Gray and Summer Sky are not prescription. We are gonna start off with Lavender Gray. These have a 14.5 diameter and then an 8.6 base curve. And then the colored ones have a 14.2 diameter with an 8.6 base curve. I can't remember, and my prescription is a minus 3.25. I can't remember what the specs are for my natural. Oh yeah, okay, there's more cases in here, so we are set. I can't remember what the diameter specs are for my non-colored prescription lenses, but I'll go ahead and put those on the screen as well so you guys can know the difference. But that's basically just how big the lens is. The base curve is how curved it is off your eye and then the diameter is how big the lens is. So depending on the size of that, you may feel the lens on your eye a little bit more, but it's still gonna fit well. All right, I moved in a little closer so you guys can see. Right now, this is my standard lens. So just my brown eyes, nothing else with my contacts on. So I will show you what comes in the pack. This is the non-prescription lavender gray and it came with a case, and then it also comes with these plastic tweezers to help grab them, and then this little tool that you can use to put the lens on to put it in your eye. If you saw in the other contact lens review I did, I don't like those. I've been putting contacts in for years, so I'm going to use my fingers. So I'm gonna take my contacts out first, and then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put one of the colored contact lenses in so you guys can see that. And then see the difference and see, I don't know, I just, I love color contact lenses. We talked about that before, but it's just something about being able to change up your look. So again, this is the Tint Iris Lavender Gray. So just like I said before, when you look at the contact lens, you probably cannot see that, I can't see. But you want to make sure that it is not concave so that the edges are curved like a cup. You don't want them to bow out. That means you have it inside out. But this one is okay. So I'm going to go ahead and pop that on my eye. And that is lavender gray. And I think that is gorgeous. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the other one in and then you'll be able to see how they look together. All right, so this is the first pair, Lavender Gray. I'm such a nut. I just told you guys that these are not prescription and then I put them on and I was like, why can't I see? Because they're not prescription. So things are a little blurry for me, but these feel really good on my eyes. I don't feel like it's like, you. I actually feel this one a little more than I do this one, but I also just stuck myself in the eye on this side. So that might be why, my error but I love how these look. They're gray, and then there's a little bit of purple. I can't see. There's a little bit of purple on the inner rim, but it's a grayish purple, like it's a cool toned lavender purple. So absolutely love these, and I'm glad they suggested them. Let's go on to the next pair. All right, so now we're gonna move on to the second pair. This is Summer Sky, and these are also not prescriptions, so I don't have anything in my eyes right now. Ooh, these are like a blue. These are blue on the outside with a lighter brown on the inside. I remember looking at these and thinking they were pretty, but I saw that they weren't prescription, so I didn't want to get them. I would be the one to wear non-prescription contacts and put my glasses on just to be extra. So I'm really happy that they sent these, but I'm just going to get everything set up. This looks like it'll be really light, but it's pretty. Make sure I have this right. All right. Ooh, that is gorgeous. I love this color. Let me hurry up and get the other one in because I cannot wait to see. Gotta give my eyes a minute to calm down. 
but there we have it this is summer sky it's weird i'm trying not to blink too much but then i also can't see so that doesn't help for some reason this eye does not feel as comfortable as the other one and i know it's not the contacts because they're the same but yes this color the name definitely does it justice i hope you guys can see the different colors in it like i said it's brown on the inside and then it kind of goes out to blue and i think it blends well with my eyes i love blue contacts on me so i think these are gorgeous all right so now we're going to move into the prescription ones so this first pair that i'm going to show you guys is glass ball which is a green i feel like this one's going to be interesting because there's a wider space between and get it out there's a wider space between where the center is to the outside so it looks like it'll show more of my brown and then go green oh that one feels good okay that feels way better and i oh i love these i love these i love green i love green eyes on me and I think the way these fade and then that outer rim, these look like they could be my eyes. All right, guys, I'm not sure if I actually told you my final thoughts on that, on the glass ball green. I'm sorry, I was excited and I started taking pictures and then I took them out to get ready for the next pair and I can't, <laughs> I can't remember if I showed you both of them. So I'll insert a picture, but I love those. I love the way they fade and have the circle around the outside so i think they look a little more natural but either way i love green eyes on me i love blue eyes on me y'all know that's my favorite so love those next we still have three more pair my poor eyeballs but i gotta do it this is the premium green so we will see another green these definitely will be more green i can already tell just from looking at the lens it's weird. These almost look like a neon almost in the pack. It's very, very green. And the center is a lot smaller. So on the glass ball green, the center around my iris was bigger. So you saw a little bit of my brown. This one is smaller. So I don't know if you'll see as much. And it also does not have that ombre effect. So... It will not be the fade, but that is what these look like. Yeah, see, these are not as natural as the other ones. These are just like, wham, bam, you have a green eyeball. Like, these will be more for, I want something drastic. It doesn't even matter. I'll probably just wear them every day either way. I just... I think it looks good, but like I said, these are not as natural as the glass ball green. So keep that in mind if you're looking for a green pair. I'm gonna go ahead and pop this other one on. Ooh, baby. They look good with my eyeshadow today though. All right, so this is the premium green pair. Like I said, these are not as natural as the last pair that I had on. As you can see, and I'm sorry my eyes are a little red, it's getting towards that point where it's like, all right, how many times are you gonna do this? You're touching me too much. Um, as you can see in the middle, these do not have the ombre effect. So it's literally just brown and then a green circle starts and it's all green. So if you don't care about it looking natural and you just wanna go for a wow shock effect, these are gonna be good for you. I think these are like super bright like that is really green almost like i said earlier like a neon green and they match my eyeshadow so like these they do feel comfortable i will say that i feel like these don't usually when you go to put a contact in if it's flipped and it's inverted it bows out a lot on the edges so you can see it kind of like goes down then this versus just a natural bowl shape. And I don't feel like these bow out that much when you have them inverted, so I can't tell. I've put them in inverted twice so far. So that's one thing to keep in mind. You may have a little trouble with that, but other than that, I think the contacts are beautiful and they fit well. So let's move on to the next pair. Our next pair is the paired 
colored ochre. I would say okra, but I'm sure that's <laughs> that's not how you're supposed to say it, but that's how we say it in Louisiana. So it's O-C-H-R-E. And these are like a hazel. No, that's right. So that's ochre. So yeah, definitely, it almost kind of looks a little green, but it's definitely more of a natural contact. And it's also, yeah, it has that ombre effect on this one as well. So I like this one and it's more of a brown. It's not a stark green. So I like that. It's different from the other ones I have. All right, this is the second, second, this is the fifth pair. I don't know what I was thinking. This is the ochre pair. And as you can see, like I said, these are more natural than the last green pair that we tried on, but they are more of a brownish green than they are just a standard green or a lime neon green like the other ones. So I like this, it's not too, What's the word I'm looking for? Like, it's not too stark of a difference. It's still different from my natural eye color, but I feel like it blends well. And of course, like I said, looks a little more natural. So now we're gonna finish with my pair that I'm most excited about, and that's the purple ones. Are y'all excited? Are y'all excited? Because I am excited. Okay, these are, ah, these are the violet pair. This is gonna be drastic. They do have a little bit of an ombre effect to them, but it's purple. I mean, like super purple, not gray purple, not blue purple. It is stark. Let's see if I hold this up. And I'm sorry if you guys can hear the construction, but this is what it looks like. That is purple. Is she focused? I can't tell. I can't see. Anyway, you'll see it on my eyes. We are gonna go ahead and put this baby in. Oh my God, these are gonna be so drastic. Oh, but I love it. Look at that. That is purple. That is freaking purple. Y'all tell me what you think. I know it's not natural, but you can't tell me this is not gorgeous. You cannot tell me that. I'm gonna put the other one in real quick and then I might keep these on. I ain't even gonna lie. I'll be right back. All right, guys, so this is it. <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie, it's been about 15 minutes because I've taken so many pictures. I, <laughs> look, I can't stop looking. Like, this looks freaky as hell, but I love it absolutely love it and i'm probably gonna order like five more pairs of just these i am not even lying like they feel good these feel I, I don't know why but i feel like these feel better than the other ones that i've tried they're all the same it says fresh and go i don't, I don't know maybe it's just because i want to love them and they love me back but these are gorgeous these are my favorite pair hands down no question so again, I wanna say thank you to Tint Iris for sending these to me. I'm so glad I found this company because look, these contacts are going to be in my rotation for as long as I can wear contacts. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. They did also give me a coupon code for you guys. So I will have that down below in the description box and right here on the screen. Go ahead, check out their website, order your contacts, try these. If you love purple, try these. I promise you won't be disappointed. Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.